Today, friends, I have got a trick that we're going to use to make our YouTube videos better for the entire world. So let's get cracking. So, friends, as you probably know, I teach Tinkercad via YouTube. This is one of my tutorials. You can see it's got 3,000 views. It's from five months ago. Of course, if you're working with my tutorials, you can turn on auto-generated captions. You can also take this under settings, and you can set them to whatever you want using auto-translate. I love that this makes my content accessible for users all over the world. Real quickly though, let me show you a new feature that YouTube has rolled out. If we move down to one of my recent videos, of course it is about Tinkercad again, once again a super fun project. Of course it has captions, but check this out. If you go to settings, it has nine different audio tracks. YouTube now has an awesome feature where it is auto dubbing my voice so you can hear it in different languages. Real quickly, I'm going to unpause it and let's hear what HL Mod Tech sounds like in German. Es sei denn, ihr macht sie öffentlich. Wenn ihr wie wir ein ganz neues Design erstellen wollt, klicken wir auf 3D Design erstellen. Als er now, I can confirm that I cannot speak German. But now if German is your native language, you can switch the audio track and you can switch the subtitles so it matches your native language. As an educator, being able to differentiate the content for every user is fantastic. All right, so let's back up to this video that once again has no languages. So the first thing I'm going to show you is that if we want to get subtitles to show up, the trick is to hit edit subtitles. I'm going to edit the timings and then I'm going to look for something to change. So I'm just editing this so that it has a capital T, add the comma. I do not want Tinkercads. So I'm going to back this up and change it to the real Tinkercad. This was auto completed and I'm just tinkering with it a little bit. And once I've made those few adjustments, of course, you could do many, many more. I'm going to simply hit publish to get the new ones up there. Now, YouTube automatically adds these most times. For some reason, it did not on this one, but I'm going to simply show you the manual way. I'm going to hit add language. I'm going to quickly add Dutch and notice it needs the title and description. Now, because I have two buddy, I can hit auto translate and bam, it completes that for me. I'm going to hit update. Now I'm going to click over here on Dutch and I want the subtitles everywhere. So I'm going to hit add. And because I did this quick edit, I now have an auto translate button. If you do not do that edit, if you just have the default, this will be gray. Auto translate is simply a one click step and bam, we have now got captions added in Dutch, but I don't have the audio. And this is what I was hoping to do was to get the audio. Friends, I've got a technique. Check this out. We're simply going to re upload that project. So I'm going to hit create. So I save every file I create. If, since I know the file name, I can simply type it in, track it down, and we can re-upload it. Now, because I already built this, I can reuse the details. Let's see if we can track it down. Of course, I remember the name of that video was Feature Fix. I can grab all of this because I know it's correct. It is the exact same video. I am also going to use the same thumbnail which I'm simply going to grab from before as well. I'm going to keep everything else, just hit next and knock out the normal choices. And for a minute, I'm going to simply save it as unlisted. Okay, so this video is up. It is still unlisted. I did just add the cards. I do want to show you this. I use TubeBuddy, which is pretty slick. It has got templates, so I can add the cards in one step. You can see the ones for this one are right here. It is such a time saver if you want to learn more about TubeBuddy. Of course, there is a link in the description. At the moment, I'm just going to cancel out of this because this one already has them. I just want you to know how awesome TubeBuddy is. As I said, it's only been up here a few minutes, but check this out. If we go to languages, it currently has none, but check it out. All I did was hit edit subtitles so that I could see mine, check the settings, and then I'm going to capitalize the T. Everything else looks good enough. I will add the comma just because it's kind of cool and the comma. And if I hit publish, check it out. These already dropped in and they're processing. I'm going to back out and let's make this thing public. 
once again on this page i'm just going to simply hit public and then we'll check and see just how long it takes for those different languages to arrive i have just opened the first video as you can see it's only been up here for 11 seconds i'm going to add a quick comment explaining what's up here is my note showing that it's been created to have it published in many languages i do want to say thank you to whoever was watching this video first real quickly i'm going to show you that it's 906 and the video has been up there for a minute it is it has got two views i am going to keep checking back and i will tell you the exact time when the new multiple languages arrive or at least the exact time ish so as you can see these are currently all in processing and it's been a few minutes and i may have lost focus for about 10 minutes but check it out there are already a bunch of these published there are also titles and descriptions just like that so i'm going to bounce this back to full screen now i also want to show you quickly if you want full subtitles of course the first thing we did was make that modification now when you click on any of these you can click on manual subtitles and the auto translate is available simply click it and publish and not only do you have the audio you have also got the subtitles of course now i just repeat those steps there you go after just a couple minutes now my content is ready for the world all right so this is the video that started this all the user said they would love to have this in german as you can see it was not there so i followed these exact same steps boom it was published and then here's the bonus the original video published on march 21st had 1800 views this video published on june 15 had 1300 views in a single day you may notice here that it went from 706 to 705. This was me using the edit tool to try and trigger the auto translate by myself. I trimmed out a single second of blank space, just trying to get it to auto update. Unfortunately, that trick did not work. So of course I switched to the re-upload trick that I just showed you and check it out. More likes and in a single day, almost the same number of views. How cool is that so there you are steps to get a dubbed voice on one of your older videos would be awesome if youtube had a button where we could just click and do that but as you can see there might be a huge bonus to re-uploading content you created earlier friends as i wrap up i do want to say thanks to everybody that's chosen to support me via youtube memberships three different levels of support starting as low as five dollars a month and with any level of support, you get early access to videos. I do also want to say thank you to my supporters via Patreon. Love how that group is growing. You really need to check out the awesome discussion board. Of course, you can learn more with the bit.ly up above or the link in the description. Finally, friends, I want to thank you for watching. Don't forget every time you hit that like button, share a video, add a comment down below, or click subscribe. You're helping HL Mod Tech get just a little bit bigger, which absolutely makes my day. Friends, have a glorious day and keep tinkering.